Good afternoon, class. So in today's video, what I'd like to do is to is to say this is the non-clickbait version of what I did in, in that last video on that was my April Fool's joke. This one I can take a little bit longer to show you the two night checkmate. This is actually the hardest checkmate to pull off in chess. And look, I'm not Grandmaster Hikaru Nakamura. I'm not Magnus Carlsen. So to actually show the checkmate pattern to get the king into this scenario, I'm not going to show that part because I'll leave it to, for the grandmasters to show you. However, what I do want to point out is I want to show you first why, if I take away this pawn, why this checkmate is actually impossible. Because if you see right here, if I put if I or if I put my king, let's say I'll put the king over here, and I've got my king over here. This is actually checkmate. So technically, this checkmate should be possible. If you can get this, if you can get the king into the corner and then checkmate with the knight, this should be possible. However, it is not possible, and I want to show you why. So the reason why this is impossible, and it kind of goes back to, let's say, this part. This let's start from over here. So we've got the knight, knight over knight blocking this square right here, king blocking off these squares. So this the black king has only these two squares to go to, right? This one and this one. So all we need to do is get our two knights here and here. And then and then the king right here is in checkmate. So that's all we have to do. But to get the two knights over there is actually, it actually requires two moves. One or one extra move than it would require for stalemate. So let, let's see, what, what does that even mean? How do we find that out? This is what I mean. So we're here, and this king is moving is restricted to only two moves. So if I were to sit, let's say, put my knight here and say check, I could force the king into this corner. However, to get this knight over here requires one move and two moves. Then I can get checkmate. However, as you'll notice, as soon as I go from here to here, this king cannot move. Therefore, this is stalemate. However, and that's why it's important that we have that we have this pawn here. So, and the pawn can be really anywhere on the board so long as it's not going to capture any pieces, but let's keep it over here for now. And let's go back to our, our scenario, right? We started over here. This king is only restricted to these two moves, right? So first we force the king over here. King is king is over here. Now we move our knight over here and now normally this would be stalemate because this king cannot move this king cannot move at all cannot go back over here because of the knight cannot go up or, or diagonally because of the king however it is permitted to have one move which is that move and then we can come in with this second this last knight and checkmate the king so if you can get this king to get into the corner like that as long as there's the and it and it's very important it cannot be you having this piece you cannot you cannot have this pawn if you have this pawn it's entirely possible to checkmate because to checkmate because this this pawn will be able to cut off other squares as well and you can possibly promote it with two knights and a pawn but if you have only two knights if you're if you're white and you only have two knights your opponent is required to have one pawn at minimum as long as this is the case, this is sufficient for checkmate. You can you can pull off a, a checkmate from there. Otherwise, unfortunately, like I said in my clickbait video, this is impossible to get to because of this ex this extra move. Because of this extra move, I cannot get a checkmate from here. That's why this is insufficient checkmate material, whereas this is. So I thought I'd point that out as, as the hardest checkmate to pull off in all of chess. So now that I've completed my series on checkmates, um, let me know what other um, strategies and or, um, or topics you want me to cover in the realm of chess. Good luck on your chess journey. Study hard. I'll see you in the next video.